What's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to use an MDI form in Visual Basic 6.0. When you launch your Visual Basic IDE, you go to your Add Form option, click MDI Form, click Open. Now this is your MDI form. Now this is how I want my form to look. Okay, if you notice, you can't add things directly on your MDI form. Exactly. When you drag this, nope, you can't. Oh, double click on it and you still can't add. Well, that's not a problem. Just add a picture box. The MDI form takes a picture box. Here's your picture box. You drag it down. drag it down and there you have it well I want to still be able to view my MDI form so I'll reduce the width of the form to 9000 my picture box to about 9000 oh. oh sorry you first of all go to align change it to align left and then you reduce 900 9000 i have it here 9000 this is my mdi form now the here i have my command button already if i drag this to this part of the form you notice the MDI form is hiding it because picture box the picture box can only be out. you can add a picture box to an MDI form but you can't add command buttons for the sole reason that controls without the align property cannot be placed directly on the MDI form this is it that's just a simple trick Place a picture box over your MDI form, then place all your properties on the picture box. You can add a text editor, sorry, a te um, edit text, a text box. You can add a text box, a frame. You can add any property, any control property of, on your picture box over your MDI form. Thank you very much for watching. See you guys in the next tutorials.